Today, I'm going to show you how that for every single pair of even numbers, the result of their sum when you add them together is also even. Let's illustrate this with a motivating example. Take four, which can be rewritten as two times two, and six, which can be rewritten as two times three. We know that both of these numbers are even because they can be written as two multiplied by some other number. When we add four and six together, we get 10, which can also be rewritten as two times some other number, in this case, five. Now, we want to be able to generalize this, make this possible for every single even number pairing, because proving this by hand for every single pair of even numbers would take a really long time. So inspired by Chili Math and my conversations with Professor Robinson in the Wake Forest Math Department, I'll show you first how to create two even numbers, add them together, then regroup them based on what they have in common, and finally identify that their sum is indeed even. So let's take two numbers, any ones you want, x and y. And to make sure that they're even, let's multiply them both by two. So we'll have two x and two y. We'll take the sum of them next, giving us two x plus two y. Awesome. So now we'll take what they have in common and rewrite two x plus two y as two times the sum, the addition of x and y. Now we can rewrite x and y as anything we want because it just represents a single number. I'm going to call it n. So now we have 2n. We can show that this quantity 2n is even because we can divide it by 2 and have just n left over with no remainder. It divides out very smoothly. Because of this, we've shown that for every single selection of two even numbers, the sum is also even. And now we've saved a whole lot of time by avoiding having to sum up every single even number pairing to see if their results are even. Thanks for listening.